Yeah. Hey, Amen. Praise the Lord. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's yes, sir. Time. For short, because we ain't got it all day for the whole name. That's another episode. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to get started with this episode. We're going to answer your questions. And everything that you're looking for, Bishop going to fix them holes in your flows. He's going to fix them doors and your toes if you need to. Uh, the first question is coming from Mercedes Benz. Um, she says... That the organ lady been playing since I was a kid. And I'm 55. Lord Jesus. How can you tell her it's time for her to hang it up? Well, Mercedes, unless you have, you're going to send your stimulus check over here or to your pastor, I need for you to stay out there bidding. That's the money bidding. That's not for you to kind of handle right there. That lady is all your pastor can afford. Because you probably ain't paying your tithe. And you know it takes money to run the church. Okay, okay. So the next question we got from Brother Ahmad. Ahmad, I think that's how he say his name. I hope that's how he say his name. Bishop, every time we go to the church and walk in, the usher, the usher, I'm sorry, the usher, give us a program and a mint and says, welcome. But when the well comes out, it don't be well with my soul. What should I do? Okay, I'm glad you asked, Brother Ahmad or Ahmad or Ahmad. Uh, let me help you out if I can. So what you got to do is go to the Dollar General or Do Family Dollar or Dollar Tree and go into the, get the little small travel size Listerine. Put it in your pocket. Put it deep in your pocket. And then when you make it to that usher, you wrench around there. Wrench around and get it at your pocket. And when she gives you the program, you give her the list of ring. But you got to do it in secret and in love. God, I, I done been there before because I done had a couple of ushers. I had to kick off the usher board for their breath. And we had to put them on the back row of the pew. Um, but that's enough. another story for another day. So, next question. It says from Alexis, okay, we got a lot of car visitors out here today. I wonder why they say the doors of the church are open, but they never open. Well, you know what? I'm glad you asked, huh? What church you know doors going to ever be open? Because you know they got to clean up. Your house, you always say that your house is a home. You can come by here anytime, but when we come, you don't lock. So what you expect the church to do? We can't keep it all day long open for everybody to come in and take the church pews and the programs and then we got to take your stimulus check and put it back in there what we done lost. So I need you to leave the door closed when the time is for to be closed. Okay? Next question. Bishop, why do you stop selling hot plates? Huh? That's a good question. Because I can have a hot plate right now. Have some wings. Some greens, beans, potatoes, tomatoes, lamb, or ham, chicken, turkey, you name it. Well, they stopped selling the plates because people stopped running to the church for food and they started to go to churches and the Popeyes and the, and the KFC, which I don't understand why because Sister Bernice, she do the chicken so well, it make you want to slap your mama. Not me, but slap your mama. Uh, so, I don't know, but you know what? That might be a good idea. Maybe if y'all open it back up 
and get that cake lady to make all them good cakes. You won't have to send your stimulus check and you can spend it however you want to. And we got one last question. It said, um, I have always wondered. It's an unknown person, by the way. I've always wondered why the pastor always get water and nobody else get water. Well, that's a good question. How often do you see anybody else talking? The person that do the most talking is the pastor. And guess what? The associates or the assistants are there to associate. That means they got to talk to the pastor so he don't fall asleep. Because he may have had a long night praying for the church. And the assistant is supposed to assist him in getting him warm. Amen. Once again, I want to thank y'all for joining our show. And we want to let you know that it's good to see, it's good to be here. And you can reach me at Bishop Fix My Church at Facebook.com or on that Insta face or Instagram at Bishop Fix My Church at Instagram. Praise the Lord. Well, that's all the time I have for today. Come on back on next week. Next week for another episode of Bishop Fix My Church.